Let's go ahead and test this now. We made some users, put them in groups, Austin Powers and Dr. Evil. Um, let me recurse out here. Print working directory when I go to home. So CD dot what will recurse up one level. Do a long listing. And if you notice, let me, again, let me blow this up here. So you can see better. But you'll notice, um, in this case, every user that logs into the system needs a home directory and it should be owned by that user and in that user's group. So what we want to do, let's make um, make a directory for Dr. Evil and for Austin Powers we'll make a directory do a long listing, but as you can see, the problem is Austin Powers is not the owner of his directory, nor his group, and the same with Dr. Evil. So let's remedy that. We'll use chown and ch group, and Austin Powers should own Austin Powers, and Dr. Evil should own Dr. Evil. And let's change group. And Dr. Evil Evil. And Okay, now I've got what we want. In this case, Austin Powers owns Austin Powers. And C Germany owns C Germany, and Dr. Evil owns Dr. Evil. So again, let's go out to the root, and we'll look at the permissions. Here's our top secret. And we set the sticky bit, but in this case, you know, only the group membership good guys has permission to go in here. And let's actually, let's tighten this permission up a little bit so that other doesn't have permission to read that directory. Now we've got, remember the SUID, the SGID, and the sticky bit set here. So what we want to do is we want to remove all of the normal permissions for the other group. Do chmod and we'll leave all the special permissions on. All the permissions for root in this instance, all the permissions for the group, and no permissions for other. And let's see how that changes things. If you look now, okay, the owner C Germany, he's got full permission. The group is Good Guys. Good Guys has full permission, but other has no permission. So if I log in as somebody who's not a member of Good Guys, I should not be allowed to go into this folder and do anything. That will be our test. Now let's check our groups again. Um, let's make sure that Dr. Evil is not a member of Good Guys. He's a member of Bad Guys. And Let's check. Uh, let's check Austin Powers. And Austin Powers is a member of Good Guys. So I'm going to exit, and we're going to log out. And the first one we'll test is Doctor Evil. So let's log out here. And. Login is Dr. Eve, uh, whose password is a simple password. Now his desktop will be created in his respective folder. And let's go here, grab our terminal, and let me blow this up a little bit. I have to be careful using the expression blow up around Dr. Evil, but um, now he's in home Dr. Evil. Let's see if he can recurse out and print working directory. Okay, now we can see top secret. And again, 
see Germany has all the permission plus the SUID is set. Uh, the good guys group right here has all permissions, 777, and in this case the um, SGID is set. But here, notice the lowercase t is capital T. The sticky bit is set, but other group has no permissions. That, remember that was CH modded to be zero. Now, Dr. Evil's not a member of good guys, so let's see if he can go into top secret. So we'll try to traverse that directory. Can't CD to top secret. So in this case, Dr. Evil does not have permission. Now let's log out as Dr. Evil and log in as Austin Powers and see if he has permission to go into our top secret directory. So, Austin Powers. And, of course, Austin Powers is our hero. He's smart. So he uses long, complex, cryptic passwords that use uh, a combination of alphanumeric characters from at least three of four categories, which would be uppercase, lowercase, and a symbol or a number, or all four, possibly. Um, let's go ahead and open a terminal. And again, if we look at our working directory, we're in Austin Powers home folder. I could recurse twice, or I could just do this, CD, and that puts me at the root level. Oh, I keep forgetting you guys can't see. Let's, again, let's kind of blow this up a little bit. We'll zoom in. And blow that up a little bit more. There we go. Okay, now, now you can see, it, hopefully. Okay, so in this case, good guys. Same permissions. Now Austin Powers is a member of Good Guys. In this case, we're we're in, or we should be in. So let's try to go to Top Secret, and there we are in Top Secret. And let me clear. I'll print the working directory. We're in Top Secret, and now Austin Powers has access to Death Ray. Master plans, the particle beam weapon, and world domination. So we we successfully kept Dr. E.